inside it. Someone at the door. The looks of it. Get a hold of her. Please, help me. Anyone. Get the hands. I heard they can't do no spells without hands. You know nothing of magic. into a corner. Do you think we can find out who she was?
bugger off. I've heard about the Circle of Magi outside of the Imperium, but I've never been in one. Are you certain it's wise for us to come here, considering who we're with? It would help if you didn't ask questions like that. Yes, why don't you just wave a sign over our heads? This seems more like a prison. I wonder if it's more effective than the circle I know. How is the Imperial Circle of Magi different? Once upon a time, it was as it is here. The Chantry watched the Magisters closely for any signs of corruption or weakness. Then it changed. The Magisters were permitted to watch over their own, and Templars kept only to enforce the law. What happened next was inevitable. The Magisters rule again, as powerful as they ever were. According to everything I've seen, the Circle can't control mages anyhow. And what is the alternative? Freedom is a noble ideal, but I see no oppression here. I see fear and danger. But enough. I'm sure we came here for a reason. We have found neither hide nor hair of the lad, Fainreal. I can only think he has fallen victim to demons or slavers. I found this. It was addressed to you. It seems to be from your daughter. My daughter? Then... You know what she is. How she died. When I traced her to that warehouse, I should have forced her into the circle. My own weakness in the face of her pleas is what destroyed her. It is why I urged Ariani not to give in when Fainreal wished to hide. If only I had been so strong for Olivia. She was an abomination. She deserved to die. And you'd better pay up if you don't want that news getting to the Night Commander. Cruel and petty. Seems only fair. You monster. Fine. Money is what you wish to avoid dragging my Olivia's name through the mud. You shall have it. Now be gone. Welcome, my dear friend, to Sol's shop. My name is Solifitus. Please take a look around. My apologies in advance. Our shelves are a bit bare at the moment. Actually, if you're interested, I could use a bit of help to remedy that. Talk. All business. I like you. 
Oh, it's been too dangerous to leave the city of late, and the substances I require for my creations are, of course, elsewhere. Uh, perhaps you could find them. You'll be compensated for your time, have no fear. I'll also give you first pick of my new creations. Make up a list of what you need, and I'll keep an eye out for you. Perfect. A discount on everything in the shop, Sirrah. Many mages resent the history of the gallows. It does not trouble them. Ever missed to winter? I was a slave. Still, it was your home, right? The only one you remember. Does it ever feel strange?
chose not to be there. Sometimes. Insist if you must, but Viscount Dumas will see no one. If you've news of Seamus, I will relay it to him. Fine. Tell Dumas my scouts have tracked the boy and his canary captor to the wounded coast. I'm taking a full company after them, and when I return, I expect him to make a show of the reward. So many to deal with one Kunari seems... excessive. He may be tell the shot. The winters leave nothing to chance. Get out of my bloody way! Yes, what is it? Looks like I'm not the only one who saw the bounty posting. Apparently so. And I am regretting it. As I told the others, Viscount Dumas' son, Seamus, is missing. We suspect he was taken by a Kunari. If you would like to try your hand at securing his safe return, feel free. I have certainly granted no exclusivity to the Winters and their violent approach. I'll drag the boy back here soon enough. Declare it if you like, but the reward goes to whomever brings him back safe. A discussion you are welcome to have with the Winters, should you encounter them, on the Wounded Coast. How much longer do I have to wait? The Viscount. Not much room in the barracks, but there's nowhere I'd rather be. There's Jevon's office. Wait while I explain our initiative. I don't know how they do it where you're from, guardswoman, but I decide the patrols, not you and your whims. You may have been put up for lieutenant in your first year, but I'll have no show-offs in my command. Have I made myself clear? Report to your post before I have you and your Ferelden accomplice jailed. You took more than I thought you would. Why would it matter which guard killed those bandits? It's not the first time he's made me wonder like this. Something is very wrong. So, let's find out whose toes you actually stepped on. Then we should check the duty roster, and see who was supposed to take that route. What have I stepped in this time? Threaten my friends. Not letting that one go, Cap. Aveline! I owe you for clearing that ambush the other night. Saved me a mess of trouble. Brennan, that route was yours? It was. Single patrol. I'd have been dead for sure. So there was nothing unusual about it at all? It had been clear for weeks. It didn't get unusual until after we heard about you and Aveline. The captain reassigned me after he heard what you did, and I passed the satchel to Donick for his patrol tonight. Mm, the satchel? Pay and order assignments. Captain has us run deliveries to the outposts during light duty. It's usually just an updated copy of the roster. The satchel for that night was heavy, though. Anyway, 
Thanks again, Aveline. You're a good one. So the satchel gets heavy the same day we discover an ambush? A messy way to pass information. Brennan already sent it along. Another guard is walking into the same trap. I can't let that happen. Brennan said Donick. A good man. Donick, Donick. I've got his route. A night walk in Lowtown. Let's go make sure his quiet patrol stays that way. The guard will throw you out if you kick that wall one more time. Throw you out if you kick that wall one more time. Can't waste time, Hawk. Guardsman Donick is here somewhere. We must be getting close to the ambush. I'm not losing. and they came out of nowhere. I took a few down, but there were too many at once. The captain said this route was supposed to be quiet. The seal of the Viscount. Office details. City accounts. Valuable to a guild of thieves. A sacrificial delivery with one of our own. Captain Jevon will answer. Selling out his own? Forget guard, Captain. This man needs to be in government. Not now, Hawk. Jevon needs to see how justice works. This goes to the office of the Viscount. This will be known. The Captain likes his thieves so much. Let's see if they welcome him in prison.